you. Yeah, um, yeah, um, the boss kind of gave me a heads up that you were heading here, so <sighs> you have to excuse the mess, you know. We just thought we'd like get you to come to one of our like smaller hideouts, just because we thought one of our bigger, flashier ones might have been a bit too obvious, and you know. We don't want any of the other gangs following you here, do we? No, that just would be super bad. But anyway, you're probably wondering why we invited you. So, well, it's just that, you know, our boss, she's been watching you. Yes, you. <laughs> and she is actually pretty impressed with you. Yes. You know, she's been, what, like, sort of, she's seen some of the things you've been up to. You know, sort of, you know, let's just say, you know, some of the, um, robberies you've done and some of the hits you've done on casinos and stuff like that yeah she, she thinks that you know for a group of guys such as yourself you know pretty small numbers you've been doing pretty well for yourself and I must admit I've been pretty impressed as well <sighs> sorry I'm so rude I didn't introduce myself did I know I'm Sean Dave how you doing nice to meet ya <laughs> but yeah as I was saying, we've all been pretty impressed with you. And we might just have a little offer for you. It's a small one. Which probably actually would be to your advantage. And to ours as well, because, you know, we want to be rebuild the Third Street Saints. So, you know, all the bots we can get together are, you know, better than them. Or better than a poke in the eye, at least. You know, can't go wrong. <laughs> so, yeah. You have talents that, you know, we're thinking might just be useful for us. Because, you know, that hit on that casino that time, you know, that was pretty impressive. That is definitely up there with the hit that we did that time. So, yeah, I mean, and considering there's only, like, what? Four? Five of you? Something like that? Yeah. Four, so. The fact that you managed to pull that off with, like, a complete lack of manpower, you know. That really does take some doing. So. And also, I've been hearing on the grapevine around the city that apparently you're pretty good at hacking and finding dirt on people. So, yeah. We could definitely do more people like yourself. I mean, yes, there's like, you know, I'm not too shabby at computer hacking, you know. Yeah. But definitely sort of having more people like you on board definitely gonna help and you know I've heard that your other guys have talents you know don't sort of you know like lip, like like sort of lock picking and you know stuff like that you know it may not seem like sort of massive talents but trust me in a gang like ours anyone who's got any kind of skill whether it be anything like small like lip sort of lock picking right up to like massive full-on you know, computer hacking, getting funds, stuff like that. You know, you're all useful. You all have your place in the game. You know, so in the Third Street Saints, we do look after our own. You know, don't let anyone tell you otherwise. I mean, yes, okay, you know, our boss was, you know, out of the picture for quite a few years. Uh, yeah, you heard about that? Yeah. She was kind of stuck in prison in a coma for quite some time, so, you know. But she's back now. It's all fine. So yeah, it's great that she's finally got herself back in the picture again. So, but yeah, you are. You have some information for us that you might want to give to us. Oh yeah. What on the camera? Yeah. Okay. Ooh. Yeah, I see what you mean. This could be pretty useful. Yeah, I see what you did there. You brought your own bargaining tool. I like you. <laughs> no, you're you're a clever one, you are. You've obviously brought this with you to sort of make sure that you get a good deal out of this. Yeah, we definitely this kind of information would definitely be useful. Definitely. So what kind of deal is it you're after then? Mm. Yeah, I'm 
sure I could talk to the boss about that. Because definitely this kind of information definitely probably get you some leeway in the gang. Definitely. And as I said, you and your guys do have some talents, so we'd definitely be interested in hiring you. Yeah. Sure, I can talk to the boss and see if she'd be interested in those terms. So, can we sort of like convince you to join us? Yeah. Good, good, good. I'm glad about that. So, right. First port of call. You, my friend, you're going to come and help us get some people sorted out because you know we want to see in person what you can do oh our little friend here ah uh, yeah this is, this is scout yeah she certainly enjoys a bit of a rough and tumble every now and again don't you baby girl yeah yeah so you fancy joining us you know because these guys in question you know they've been after a good sorting out for a long time and it's a about time we did something about it, so it'd be great if you could join us to help us. Definitely. What, my friend here? Ah, no, she doesn't have a name. The name Hope would have given her? Well, let's just say the name Lucille I hear is already taken. By a chap who, um, yeah, I hear he's not the kind of guy you want to mess with. I hear there's a couple of guys in another gang recently got on the wrong side of him and yeah, didn't end too well from what, for them from what I hear. Yeah, I hear they're kind of not alive anymore. Yeah, baseball back to the head would do that to you, so not good. Either. So, you in? You fancy a bit of rough and tumble? Hey, cuz, come on, scouts up for it here. Shall we? Do you want to join us? Oh, go on, please. Be fun. As I said, with a guy like you, with this kind of information that you can get us, you're definitely going to be useful. And you are going to have one heck of a good pay packet out of it. Ready? Yeah, you want to come along? Great. 